Thank you. At 635 in the city of Jacksonville's emergency preparedness department has implemented the five P's plan. It's a plan to protect your homes, your loved ones during the cold weather. So let's get into the list and, and a reminder that's not less necessarily in, in the list of order of importance. It's just how they're putting this out there. We're going to start with what they have at first. Logically, we got to protect the plants, the sensitive plants, the citrus that you may have out there, hibiscus. We're going to need to get those covered, cover the cold sensitive plants or even bring them indoors if possible. This is when temperatures are in the 50s or even the 40s. Um, you get close to that freeze, you're going to have some real problems as the water within the capillaries of the branches will freeze and, and cause some issues. So take care of that because it's going to be much cooler. Also uh, protect your pets, bring in the outdoor animals, make sure to provide a warm shelter for them. The third step of protection and the most important, of course, is protecting the people in your lives, uh, dressing in warm layers, protecting your skin, getting your skin covered and protected from the wind, because when you mix the wind with these really cold temperatures, a uh, frostbite could be an issue and check in on those who may uh, be cold sensitive and have issues with heating. It's also important to protect your home's pipes. So this is one of those scenarios this weekend is certainly a scenario. We'll get the call all the time. Is this when I need to be dripping my pipes? Yes, you need to cover your pipes, the outdoor ones, the outdoor faucets, drip them very slowly to prevent them from freezing and busting, which could be a, a big issue. And step number five, practice fire safety. Use safe heating sources indoors. Be cautious about where you put the space heaters. Give them plenty of space away from walls, away from curtains and other furniture as well. Do not use an oven to warm your home and don't use fuel burning devices like grills inside, which releases carbon monoxide and would be a whole other issue. And the weather, of course, um, cold, but hopefully